ESPN Plus. Tonight from Jonesboro, Arkansas, it's the Red Wolves of Arkansas State and the Sea Wolves of Stony Brook. Stony Brook comes out a 4-2 defensive front, so it'll be interesting to see if they can run it on first down. There it is. And Cross to the 40, to midfield, still going. Cross all the way down to the 31-yard line. Daly handoff. Wallace breaking one tackle inside the 15, down to the 13-yard line. So Zavada comes in to attempt a 22-yard field goal. He's one for three on the year, missed the two at the Oklahoma game, made one last week against Memphis, and that is good. They'll try running it and across the 30 to the 31-yard line. Uh, that was uh, Ross Tallarico. Daly, the redshirt freshman, starting at quarterback tonight. Shroud, who started the first two games with an ankle injury against Memphis, throwing over to the far side, and the catch made over there, and a good grab by Courtney Jackson. Excellent throw by Daly. Cross now trying to get to the outside, and he does. And that's a first down. Jackson in motion. Plenty of time. There he goes. Daly. Down to the 30-yard line. Oh. Some room. Cross inside the 20. All right, second and 10. Wallace up the middle. Wallace still going. Wallace inside the 5, down to the 2. Big hole for Zach. Wallace. And that is close. Touchdown. Yeah. So Arkansas State gets their first touchdown of the season. Pressure. It's Tallarico in motion and open receiver down the middle. And a reception is going to be short of the first down. Opened up the slant route, but Rucker could not make the catch. Second and ten. All right, there's some room for Cross. Cross. 25-20-10. Touchdown! Jacquez Cross, 66 yards for the TD. Nothing happening right there. So third down and 12. Motion to the near side. Case looking near side. He's got some pressure. Now rolls out of the pocket. Throws it downfield and the catch made. Right there at the 44-yard line, a penalty marker goes down. It looks like he might have been out of bounds. Wall is still in there at running back for the Red Wolves. Daly looking downfield. Ely's got it. He's got the first down. And Reagan Ely to the 35-yard line. Having to be one of those erasers. Third and one. Cross. He's got the first down. First punt of the night now for Arkansas State. And William Pristop standing back at the 39-yard line. He's averaged 45 and a half on his punt so far this year. And that catch is made inside the 10-yard line and immediately brought down. Case moving out of the pocket. He's got some room to run. He's got the first down and a lot more across the 30 to the 32-yard line. Mackey and Hodges there for Arkansas State. So now after a good defensive set by Stony Brook, the offense is now starting to do some stuff as they try running it up the middle, and there's absolutely nothing there, but it's going to be enough, it looks like, for the first down. Case told Mike Anderson of the Statesman that it was during rehab that he found his religious faith. Case memorized the Bible verse, James 1, chapter 1, verse 2. With a good play right there is Case throwing the football and the completion across the 45 to the 48-yard line. First to the top of your screen. Tallarico's in motion to the near side. Case sending it downfield. Drop! Dorian tells us that uh, 
Hardiman has left the field with an ankle injury, unlikely to return as the short pass is completed. And there's a first down, just over seven minutes left to go first half. Case looking downfield. He's got his receiver at the 35-yard line. Running play and the first down. Throws it out to the far side. Not much room out there. Maybe a couple yards. The, uh, the catch made by Johnson and a little bit of action after the play with the long being 25. And that is off the upright and no good. Three minutes left to go first half. The throw, the completion, the first down. Due to gain yardage. Second and three. He's going to throw near side. And the catch made there once again. So we'll see what uh, Arkansas State does here because, quite frankly, Stony Brook moved the ball rather well in the second quarter. There's a big hole. There's room. And down to the 40 and knocked out of bounds. And what a great job blocking by that offensive line. Redmond made the block and Tallarico was able to run it down the field. And once again, they try the right side and another nice pickup there. Just underway second half. Case has got his receiver and the tackle is made, but a good job over there on the far side of the field. Pressure from the sack. 37-yard field goal attempt by Spencer Bisco. He missed his first try and this one is no good. Case wants to throw it. Got his receiver, got the first down. What a move right there. And finally knocked out of bounds at about the 36-yard line. Great accuracy tonight from second Miss Porter. Once again, again on the outside, that's there. It's been there yep. and driven out of bounds at the 25-yard line. Will that turn in? No, goodness. Third and two now. And the run right up the middle. That's a true freshman quarterback who's in there. Jalen Rayner, 435 left to go. In the third, 17-0 Arkansas State. Rayner, he's got room right up the middle. Cuts it to the near side. And Rayner inside the 30, down to the 28-yard line. Rayner wants to throw it. He's got his receiver, Stevenson, and he's inside the 15. Stevenson, the man in motion. Rayner following his blockers, and he's got the first down. Cross, cross, touchdown. And nothing going on the right side over there. And we're just starting the fourth quarter. No gain on that last play. Penalty marker down. Rayner will throw it downfield. He's got Foreman at the 40, the 50. Breaks the tackle. Finally brought down at the 40-yard line. Cross in the backfield. And Cross has got it inside the 15. There's a penalty marker down. Offside. Defense number 11. Five-yard penalty from the previous spot. Result is a first down. So third down and seven now. Jalen Rayner, true freshman quarterback, seeing his first action of the year. Got his receiver, touchdown! Touchdown, Arkansas State, Courtney Jackson. What a great job by Jackson on the route. Case is the quarterback. He wants to throw the football down. Bill's got his receiver at the 40, the 30, and finally dragged down at the 15-yard line. The ball comes loose. Arkansas State comes up with it. Carson, he's got the first down as he gets to the five-yard line. Case looking corner touchdown Hart Raymond Hart Jr. with the reception 
Leon Jones was back there for the coverage, but Stony Brook with 9.14 left to go finally gets on the scoreboard. 42-yard line for Arkansas State. Around the far side. And all the way down to the 30-yard line. Second down and six for Casey Case and the Stony Brook offense. So they'll play up out to the right side and uh, Cal Redman there with the catch. Handoff, change of direction. Hawkins coming back to their side to the 45-yard line. And uh, I think, he, got good, the first I think down. he did get first down. The true freshman Rainer got things going and uh, Arkansas State's going to come away with this uh, victory tonight. Got the first down there. So that's going to do it. So Arkansas State came into this game having not scored a touchdown in their first two games. Had only scored three points. And uh, a lot of uncertainty, Pete. A lot of injuries last week, particularly along the defensive this is front. The end of the game. And tonight, they play a good FCS team in Stony Brook. Uh, Arkansas State with a 31-7 victory.